guys. Welcome to System Test Number 8, Series 5. Let's go ahead and get started. Coming right up here for the first notification appliance, we still got the Simplex 2901-9838 behind the 293-9001 light plate from the last system test. But this time the requester has asked me to put it on code 3, so it is doing code 3. And up here, there's nothing on the wall for NAC2, but if you look up on the ceiling, got the EST Genesis ceiling mount, and this is also what the requester has requested for the second notification appliance. It, the strobe's set on 15 candela, and it's doing its usual code 3. Right here for the first conventional pull station, the requester has requested the Simplex 4251-20. And right here for the second conventional pull station, I've replaced the JBG-12L with the ADT BG-10L. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention please? We are about to set off the life and safety system at this time. Please disregard all audible and visual signals until further notice. Again, we are about to test the life and safety system at this time. Please disregard all audible and visual signals at this time until further notice. Thank you. And we are going to be starting over here today and we're going to start by activating the smoke detector over here in the corner since we've not done this by itself in a system test with the notifier system yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my magnet testing tool since I do not have any smoke saver right now. So here we go. Let's get to it. There we go. going to go ahead and hit system reset. Now I'm going to we're going to come over here and we are going to activate the key switch. Sorry, it's kind of hard to do with one hand, but I got it in. So now I'm going to turn it to test. And the system will go off and this time the MP3 speaker will go off. Here we go. Let's get to it. Now we'll hit system reset again. All right, now we'll reactivate the system again with the Simplex 4251-20. Here we go. Now we'll reactivate again with the ADT BG12L underneath the stopper. Here we go.
Alright, this time I will reset from the Annunciator. Okay, and for the semi-final part of the system test, we will activate the RTS-151 key switch. Let's go ahead and get right to it. Okay, I think that's enough of that since that bell is very annoying. And if, instead of resetting from the panel, I'll just reset from the key switch. Okay, and so for the final part of the system test, we will activate NAX 1 and 2 by manually activating them on the ACM. So, first I'm going to do NAC 1, then f 5 seconds afterward I will do NAC 2. Here we go. Three, two, one. Now nap two. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention, please? We have finished testing the life and safety system at this time. If you hear any fires or any audible and visual signals from this point forward, please obey them immediately. Again, we have finished testing the life and safety system at this time. If you hear any the audible or visual signals from this point forward, please respond to them immediately. Thank you, and I hope you all have a nice day. All right, everybody, this is going to do it for system test number eight, series five. I hope you enjoyed it. This setup was requested by Vintage Simplex Fire Alarms of New York. This system test featured the Simplex mechanical horn behind the light plate and the EST Genesis. And Fire Alarm 2903, you will be up next for system test requests. So stay tuned. Thank y'all for watching this video. Have a blessed day, and I'll see y'all next time, everybody.